Or over this way if you want to keep shooting. Okay. Where are they coming from? Hordes like to move through this area in winter. They always end up leaving behind a few stragglers. They do the same routes every year? Like a migration or something. Huh. What's that about? Well, when the barometric pressure reaches a certain temperature... St shit, I don't fucking know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, we're back. Check out the shed. It looks like they're moving downhill. Why? Hmm. Ah, uh, dead animal. Look up by the truck there. They're munching on that deer there. Guess they're hungry. All right, so I'm a bit upset. At myself, at myself. Uh, so during the birthday museum part flashback, the T Rex was outside the fucking me museum. I'd noticed it too, and I didn't get. Oh, yeah. You can climb it and everything. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't do that. So it sucks. I couldn't get that on video recording. But I like watching other YouTubers uh, go playing the game as well, just to see their reactions and. Frickin' T-Rex, man. Had to miss it. Whatever. Let's do this. Bam! There you go. Here they come. Where, where's this guy at? Let's see if I get him. Oh, missed! Shit. Gotcha. I like this thing. I'm counting three. Spotting two still. You're natural. I'm impressed. Looks clear. Bet there's some this way. That's something by the ski lifts? Look way out there. Under those gondolas. By that tower. You see it? A little bit higher. Just take there we go. What you think? View. And for more. Too high. What if I get one like this? <laughs> Let's try it. Oh, way too far. Uh. Too low. One more try. Oh, close. Okay. Just. Okay, I brought them all to the spot. The good spot. You're really getting it. Yes. Three left. Took out a leg. Well done. I have to tell Joel about this. I took one out? Didn't even know that. Alright. We got this. Channel your inner John Wick. Got him! Yeah, I've <laughs> been stirring that stew. Probably just left it to burn on the bottom. Well, I'm not seeing any more. Yeah, me neither. Alright. Let's head in. See if Joel's back. Sure. I know I said at the beginning I wouldn't comment as much, but it just comes out naturally. Sorry. And I'll try and be over. quiet. Hey, thanks for that. It's just what I needed. Sure. Ladies first. <laughs> I'm not supposed to say anything, but Joel's worried about you. There's, there's nothing to worry about. Well, I'm sure there isn't. But if you don't talk to him, he's gonna think something's wrong. I talk to him? Well, you have to do more than hi and bye. <sighs> okay, I will try. At ease, fellas.
That was y'all shooting up there, right? Oh, just some stragglers. Ellie got to try out my scope. How'd you like it? Yeah, feels good. Oh. I see you've, uh... You haven't gotten around to changing the strings yet. I didn't know I was supposed to. <laughs> yeah, you'll, uh... We'll get you some new ones. <clears throat> well, there's that music store down there. I bet they got guitar stuff. I mean, that area's long overdue for a sweep anyway. Let's see what you're doing, Tommy. I can keep watch. Where you say, kiddo? Sure. <laughs> and that's our cue. <laughs> Are you sure you don't want to come? Get on now. He's waiting. It's a nice place. This lookout suddenly fascinating. I'm just making sure I have everything. Uh -huh. That sounds beautiful. Hey, what's this savage starlight doing here? Pretty sure that's Joel's. Hmm. You coming? Yeah. So, you and Tommy cross anything when you was out? Just the few we saw from the ridge. You? Uh, you know, found two runners in a house. Jesse tells me you're handling your own quite well on the group patrol. He's even recommending you for paired patrols. Though I think you're still a bit young for it. I'm a better shot than almost all of them. And I have more experience than most of the new recruits Look, who've... Look, you think you're ready, I trust you. Okay. Thanks. You just do me a favor and start with the shorter routes for now. You know, see how you handle them. All right. Hey, you remember those, uh, Savage Starlight comic books that you're into? Yeah. Tommy and I found some when we were moving through that school the other day. Did you like them? Oh, well, you know what? It's not really my cup of tea, but... Dr. Daniela Starr, I mean, she's pretty... She's a savage. Well, what she does to Captain Ryan in that death match... Ooh. Yeah. I mean, he definitely deserved it, but... That was a nice twist how they escaped, though. <laughs> You're funny. Music stores up that way. I'm gonna have to leave the horses here. Yeah. Sounds good. <laughs> hey, Shimmer. Don't get into trouble. <laughs> There's that music store. Yeah, I see it. <sighs> Damn it.
You need a boost? I got it. Uh, I don't think we can go this way. What? Well, damn. Used to be able to swim across this. Okay, so now what? Well, if you're up for it, we can try cutting through that hotel. I'm up for it. Oh, that might be something. You think you can fit in there? Well, it's worth a shot. <laughs> Careful now. Yep. I'm through. Hold on. All right. Looking. Well, hello. Howdy. You impressed? Nope. You're just too skinny. You need to eat more. <laughs> You're welcome. This place is giving me the creeps. I think I see a way through, but we got spores. Put your mask on. <sighs> Do I have to? It's just us. What if we run into someone? Okay, fine. Eventually, you're gonna slip up in front of someone you shouldn't. I've never slipped. You ain't told nobody new, have you? Not Jesse, or Dina. Or... Of course not. Okay, good. <laughs> you ever been in here before? Uh, you just patrol the streets. Feeling like a bit of an oversight now. Maybe.
Ruby. I'm sorry if our patrol overwhelmed you yesterday. We don't run into new people too often. I understand why you might have been nervous to follow us to Jackson, but it really is a nice place. We've got electricity, good crops, could be something special for you and your family. My boys are different people here. Before Jackson, we were so focused on just staying alive. I didn't like who we were, uh, who they were becoming. They started acting like people we were running away from. These days, they're on roofs, fixing holes, digging trenches, hard work, but they come home every night excited after about about building this place. They've got community, a reason to be accountable. I uh, used to be a teacher. You could have a classroom of kids hungry for knowledge. This isn't a fantasy. Please consider just stopping by. Let me show you around. Tara. Hmm. Like it was shot a while back. When did the last patrol go through here? Not uh, sure. Is it one of us? Yeah. Well, the people went missing from Jackson and them teenagers from last year. This was too old. I would just roamed in. This way. Over here! Here comes some more! 
give up on those strings for today. Could have said it better myself. I think our only way out is spoiled now. That looks like it might be something. Following you. No more. I need gun, I need gun, I need gun.
That was too close. Sure. But we fucking did it. Ray? Yeah, we sure did. You good? Uh, you know, than being really old, ain't nothing a solid night of sleep won't shake off. I want to get out of here. What are you doing? <clears throat> what if there's like two bloaters back there? It'll be fine. Spores are clear. Oh. Quite the fight back there, huh? It's not often we get a bloater around these parts. Uh. Yeah. Jesse and Dina are gonna lose their shit when they hear about this. Let's deal with them two anyway. They're dating, right? Uh, on and off. Why? I hear the way Jesse talks about you. No, Jesse and I are just friends. <laughs> no, no, no. I've got a pretty keen eye. <laughs> Not so keen with this one. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Don't hold your breath. Think you can squeeze through there? <clears throat> See what it is? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Whoa. Hey, Joel. Huh? I think it's them. A couple that ran away last year. I think you're right. Jackson is a wonderful place, but we got tired of hearing the stories of people suffering everywhere else. We wanted to save lives. We had good intentions. We didn't make it an hour before running into a horde. Now we're bitten. We've decided we're gonna end our lives instead of turning. Please tell our family and friends that we're sorry. Love Adam and Sydney. I shot her. I can't take my own life. I'm a fucking coward. Adam. Jesus. If only they were immune, right? <clears throat> well, let's... Go get Tommy and we can get these bodies back to Jackson. After you took me out of the Firefly Hospital... Here we go. You said there were dozens of people like me. Yeah. Yeah, that's what they told me. I've never met another immune person before. 
Have you? I could be hiding it. You do. Do you believe that? Is now really the time for this? We traveled across the entire country to bring me to the Fireflies. I had so many questions for them. Why did you pull me out of there while I was still unconscious? Because I let them run their tests. And when I saw that they were useless, I got us out of there. How do you know they were useless? Maybe if you, you just uh, would have given them more time, they could have figured something uh, out. There was no cure. There's nothing that could help these people or anybody else. I know you wish things were different. I wish things were different. But they ain't. And we need to get these kids back to their families. Is there something else you'd like to rehash? Good.